this is a clip from Prince's Predator Pets. He said he didn't want this leopard gecko anymore. And so he fed it alive to one of his other reptiles for clicks on YouTube. I do not understand how this person is not banned off YouTube. This is what his logo looks like. He claims all of his content is educational, but it's very hard to say that this is not just sadistic animal snuff films. This is a Chinese water dragon that he had, and he decided he didn't want it anymore. And so he was going to feed this Chinese water dragon to one of his larger reptiles. None of these feeding setups are even remotely natural. I suppose you could justify predatory videos if it was occurring in nature or was even remotely natural, but he makes sure the prey animal can't get away. Usually when you do live feeding, um, it's because you don't have another choice, like the animal won't accept frozen thawed prey, which is the preferred choice. Live feeding is pretty controversial in the pet hobbyist community for ethical reasons. And it's pretty important to note that it's not normal to feed your pets to your other pets when you no longer want them. And that Chinese water dragons are not the natural diet of his monitor lizard. Here is another really sad clip of his gecko. Ugh. Imagine killing your pet for YouTube clicks. Can you imagine that? And, uh, this is a really long video that I cut down. This, this poor mouse or rat or whatever it is takes like 10 minutes to die. But yeah, just, you know, drowning a live rodent for the YouTube views. There are plenty of humane ways to feed, like, rodents to reptiles. Drowning them alive is uh, not among them. This is what his YouTube channel looks like, please. Report it. This is him saying he fed his pet to 